And I guess we're live. Okay, I was gonna, there they are. Can I do, let me see. Can I make anything out of them? Can I, can I, can I, can I? La 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 la, bum bum. Ba da di dum. Ba da 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 dum ba dum. Hello. This is the frugal eclectic, otherwise known as noodle. And I wonder, I suppose I could keep those. Let's see, what can I glue them on to? Well, hello, Nancy! Okay, 10.05. Okay. And put that up there. And put this in the drawer. And <sighs> my chair is full. <laughs> my chair is full. I'm still here. Still here. Hello, darn. I'm thumbing through some of Shauna's stuff. I gotta find a background. Gotta find a background. Gotta find a background. Gotta find it. Gotta find it. Gotta find the background. Let's see. Ooh, that actually might be kind of an interesting. Hmm. Maybe that one. Or, no, that one I want to, no, that one's special. Weird pointillism. Weird pointillism. Weird pointillism. But um, ba bum bum bum. All right, do I want to do that or do I want to us? I kind of have an idea for that, but let's go ahead and I'm gluing these down because I don't want to get this is William Morris. Oh, whoa, there's a whole bunch of you that just all of a sudden came in the room. Or, or of course, it could be two people who are chatty. <laughs> okay, I've said hello to Nancy and Dar. And hello, John John. And, and that sprouted roots thing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I need to sit down. But... I got happy mail and doohickey. I want them. Yep, I want them cockeyed. Mishmashed. I'm gluing them down. I should probably glue them down on thinner paper. Make it easier to stitch on. But I'm not. So leave me alone. Let's go ahead and put you here. Then I may do like a... Oh, hey, you're supposed to glue, not move. I'm telling you. Of course, your poster paper. That's my ha some of my new happy mail. <laughs> so it's got a shiny bottom. Okay, now, there. Mm. 
Yeah, just slap her. Yeah, just slap her. Then she'll be good. <sighs> I'm gluing. I'm gluing. I'm gluing. <laughs> Oh, wow. I like the glue, the Amazon glue, but I will tell you that it tastes horrible and it smells gross. So if you're eating while gluing, <laughs> just a heads up, don't do that. <laughs> just telling you, just saying. <laughs> Just saying. Oh, oh yeah, good. I do have it in front of all. I need to sit down. So I will. Hello, Kimberly. Now, oh my giggles. <laughs> we will. I will show. What's that? Oh, <laughs> my book bag. Or I should say, one of my book bags. We got one more to glue, people. But I gotta, I gotta move my happy mail here, and I gotta sit down. Last week I ended up not doing Patabon, and I'm a little, yeah. I'm moving my happy mail and my haul. <laughs> Okay, oops, I can't move my chair <laughs> right now. But I'm sitting down now. Oh. Okay, we'll get this glued. Oh, yeah, that's right. Hello, I'm the frugal eclectic, otherwise known as Noodle. I think I said that, but oh well, hey. And, yeah, now, well, hello, Tori. And I was, I didn't say anything. I was over at Dee Dee's for just about 15, 20 minutes. And I, oh, that music paper from Xandra's shop. Oh, oh, man. La, 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 la. Okay, leave room for leave room for stitching. Okay, there's that. I'm thinking about this section right here like a little book marker. And this paper is actually going to go into I have I have several files around the house that pertain to mid-century modern and certain colors. Yeah. And you know, so when I do something around the house, yeah, yeah, so this is going to go into this folder because I could use this in mid my mid-century modern colors, but, but I'm going to take, um, make a space for uh, a ruler um a doohickey <laughs> we'll get there we'll get we'll spit the word out here when i say we i mean we we will end up spitting the word out eventually just saying now this of course these little doodads if you don't know they're from uh, the when you punch the envelope maker and you get these little you get these little four pieces left over. Sometimes I like to keep them and then I let them glue and let them sit and then I 
I stitch around them. All righto. I can just stick that right there now that it's glued. glued. Okay, now. <laughs> she might be here. She might be here. She might be a wallflower. You never know. I don't know. Now. La, 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 la. Okay, we're going to give me an hour. Oh, hour and 20 minutes. I, this morning, I, ink, I, I took some extra increment times to sleep. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can tell her we love her. <laughs> and we want to bug her. We want to bug her. Now, I realized after the fact that I probably didn't show you the girls that I kind of sort of finished from the previous week, last week. So I'll show you them. But I suppose you want to see the haul and the happy mail. Okay, well, the happy mail. And I have a little piece of this is William Morris poster poster paper. And they're slightly different. This is part of the happy mail. <laughs> Judy. <laughs> oh. Oh. Parrot tulipies. Okay. And some of the, this is a little bit different colorways of some. Yeah. And they come in a roll. But the little piece of paper disappeared, got separated from it. But yeah. And this is. They're more blown up. They're a different size perspective. Um, then it, oh, look at that one. You could put pansies with this one. This is like, yeah, you can, this is the, you can like, this is like linen. You can see the linen, the, the texture of the, But I thought this would be a different perspective. You know. Okay. And here's the other bunch. Like I said, the piece of paper. But they are, they're like, I don't know, 18 by something. I guess I suppose, here, let me. If you're going to go hunt them down. But I think they're called poster. Yeah, they called them posters. 13 by probably 23 or something. I already cut one up. Some of them I will probably stretch out and frame. Because that's what the directions say that you're supposed to frame these. And use them as decorate. You know, use them as like wall art but you know <laughs> we're getting there people we're getting there okay so this is 18 so I would say we're looking at about 20 19 or 20 so 13 by 19 or 20 
And I believe, obviously, the William Morris posters. And you won't see them rolled up. You'll see them flat in a whole bunch of, you know, in the description. You'll see them flat. But let me... I'm hope yeah, so here goes. Well, oh here. There's another one in another different in a colorway. And here see they're different from the ones. This one I think is um similar to the dark the in the wrapping paper section of that book I have. It's a different a dark this is a lighter colorway. And I showed you another one that was the same but a different colorway. But this one is totally different from, okay, and this is like, oh, oh, yeah. Oh, this one, this is probably one of them. And this one here, I will put into, I will cut down or something and put into a frame. But this one here, yeah, so I let's just assume that I will frame that in some way. It'll be a funky mid-century modern. And this one here I like. Some kind of funky mid-century modern. I'm and this one is an interesting one. Now, even though it's a kind of it's got blue, I like it. And this one, even though it's got purple, you know, again, don't get the, so this is a, more of a purpley one. And then you've got this one. That one. That's like almost oriental. This one here. And this one, oh, again, the tapestry. Mm. This is yummy. Now, this would be nice. I have an idea for that one. And then this one here, I like this one too. This could also be mixed in with mid-century modern. Actually... And then I'll probably use some of this, mix this as well into some of my home art. Oh, and look at this one. See, it has it has that on it. So these are the four that I will probably use in my home art, like for the mid couple with mid-century modern for my home. These are the four that I will probably use for that. Okay, so I'm gonna actually separate those. Alrighty. And I think, did we show them all? No, not quite. I think we had, we had a few left. Okay, so here's one. And then this one here, and then this one. This would be nice too. This puts me in mind of the um, Mariposa paper, the Mariposa paper pad. I might actually use this too in the mid-century modern. The carnations, the blown up carnations. Because I will sometimes occasionally mix a little orange coral and stuff in it. So I'll set that aside. Yeah. Of course, I love this. I love the parity tulips. But anyway, so yeah, there's that part of the happy mail. Then I got black folders. Black folders. And, oh, guys, <laughs> I got me some B Paper Company white 
sketch and trace. And these were all gifted. Hello, Shana. Yeah. So I thought, you know, I want to play with black. So I thought, well, let's hunt down some black folders. Yeah, and I put them on my wish list. So, you know. Yeah. Oh, are these the shiny kind, not paper? Uh-oh. Well, we'll figure it out. Yeah, I think they are. They're the, they're the plasticky ones instead of... They're plasticky instead of paper. However, hmm, that just gives me a little more. I'll have to think about it. Hmm, I wonder how come I didn't notice that they were plastic instead of paper. I'll have to see if they have black paper. Mint black. But that's okay, because like I said, we'll get it figured out. So that's my happy mail. Oh, okay. Well, I only got white Posca. I haven't, um, <laughs> I haven't, I haven't ventured out other than white Posca. There's still, there's still quite a bit of stuff that I'm behind on, guys. You know, and you probably already saw it. I got my 13 arts order. It took 25 days, which, you know, not bad. I got two white gessos and I got a gel medium. Okay, so that's the 13 arts. That's those. One of these are still wrapped. Hello. Oh, and hello, Shauna, and anyone else that I may have missed. <laughs> oh, yeah. And, oh, guys, look at this. I finally have one. <laughs> I have this one that only apparently shows up with when it's listed with the actual dies that he has. That's the only time I ever see this. This one. Oh, but guys, 13 Arts had one. <laughs> and I go, oh! and my actually my husband added it to the order. <laughs> when I go, oh, oh wow. That's fun. You know, yeah. So I actually have one. And it's actually in black instead of red. Okay, that was part of the order. And oh guys, I got two of these because. And I had to giggle because I had to go all the way to Poland to find the typology. <laughs> so I got two of them. Yeah, the Tim Holtz typology. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm right going. We're getting two of them. <laughs> Now, <laughs> we all have to, we all have to remember to give chance, give Dorothy a chance to type. Don't bombard her with a lot of questions. I mean, she's got to burp and breathe, you know, you know, yeah. She's got to occasionally burp and breathe. Oh, come on. Don't do this. So anyway, I got two of them. I guess it's got static electricity. All right, now go back in. Yes. Thank you. So, yep, got two of them. And then I got, I don't know what I'm going to do with them. This is Chalk Burnt Sienna. 
chalk celadon. They are water-based ink. And then I got a patina bronze. I assume we just spray stuff with them. <laughs> but yeah, colors, you know. And, oh, here, here. This is the one I cut up. This is the William Morris I cut up. <laughs> I kept this one because I just liked the... This is actually a, a flower stem. But the way it looks like a tree, tree roots. Yeah, like I said, I don't know. Maybe we can spray them on that on the page today. And then, and I'm pretty sure. Okay, then, of course, who needs paper, right? Who needs more paper? <laughs> This was, I go, uh-oh, she said something that I didn't order. And then this one is gratis. So that's a thank you. This is the Amore pad. And I'm assuming she picked this one based on this one. But I'll show you the one that I got as a thank you gift. And this is actually like, yeah. All right. So let's see. It's got Paris and a bicycle. Oh, yeah, duh, a more. Okay, so we'll just do it this way. Some of this would be nice with the, um, Stamperia, the Atelier Stamperia paper that Tori got me. But yeah, that's what, the, and then they have the little doohickeys. Okay, so there's that one. And yeah, I'm putting it back into the Oh my goodness, guys, I kept the wrapping. They wrapped really well. And I don't know if if if, if you, what you how you've ordered, but my order. Um I I've, I've actually kept the Kurrigate too because I can um use that for smaller items. But I'm recycling. Okay, guys. Okay, now I'll get back to that. But this one I saw, I was just kind of going to go, oh, no, I don't need any paper. Don't need any paper. Now, this napkin I put in, this is a, I mailed a napkin. She sent me a whole pack of this. <laughs> anyway, a whole bunch of these napkins. But when I saw the Victoriana, oh, my giggles. And I thought I should have gotten two of these because they're double-sided. But... This inspires me. And also, this will go with years ago, Prima had a, it was called stationery or something. And it had these color tones. And I went, oh. So this is, and I just like, okay. And this is steampunk. I didn't realize it was steampunk. But here it goes, guys. Here goes. Yeah. And then here's the back. And like I said, I should have gotten two of these on each of the packs I picked. But yeah, this is the cut thingy in the back. Oh, and the, the uh, Finnebear Gothic stencil. Yes, uh -huh. the one with the one with the um, illuminated letter on it. That's the gothic one I got. Did I show the back on that? Oh, here. This is this is the front. I think this is the should be the front. But I'm kind of like hmm. But I do like that. Yeah. 
you could um with this one here you could almost go with a a mid purple like a lav a mid purple to a lavender i wouldn't necessarily go dark unless it was like a thin um like a fourth inch dark purple ribbon like our velvet ribbon but i'd go with a medium purple to a to a lavender you could, if you wanted to, you could actually take the slate blue that's in here. Yeah. See the color, this inspires me. I'm like, you know, my brain thinks. And here's the back of this. And it's like, oh, I need to do like some illuminated letters. Yeah. You can see why I should have gotten like two of these, but you know, and then of course this here, like the garnet and burgundy. Yeah. And this one, oh, you could bring some of, um, I don't have it with me right here to show you, but with this one, you could bring some of Shauna's the pink part of her element digital you could do that now a really interesting con i'd have to play with it though the contrast um one of the links i i checked i don't think i screenshot the actual but she there's one uh one of the links that she uh, left in shauna's description the other day the digital she has like this yellowy paper pack and i'm going oh man <gasps> yeah okay but yeah this one here puts me in mind of um shauna's that you could yeah you could mix the pink part of shauna's element thingy but there's that so i'm like okay yeah it just it just makes my brain think It makes my brain think. And yes, I'm putting them in there. I'm putting them back in. At least for now. There we go. It's much smoother when the Okie doke. Now here, this one. <laughs> okay, so in this one here, when I saw it, I saw, I guess the colors, I was remembering more of a, a pale aqua when I was ordering it. So maybe the colors were slightly off, but I am so, this is another one that I should have gotten another one with because it's called the end of summer paper pad, paper pack. And you can see just from that, but oh, and this is another one that gives me all kinds of, ooh, ooh. And this one puts me in mind of that um, 49 a Market paper pack that I got when I used Marta's link that one time. This actually a year ago, I used Marta's link and I bought some 49 a Market. I'll have to hunt that up. I put it into, it's a part of the industrial kit, the industrial renaissance kit. kit. That I have. So it's, um, I'd have to just find where my, I haven't been two spots. But um, this is this one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes.
Oh, cool. Dot. But look at that, guys. Oh, and I'm just like, okay. Now this will be this will be good with the typography. And even even the Victoriana would be nice with it. Because of the word the gothic wording in this one, you could the typography. But yeah, oh. I'm just like, okay. And oh yeah oh <sighs> yeah yummy So I'm sitting here going, hmm. So yeah. For me, this is like, okay. It's all right to have a little more paper. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. All right. Now, that is my haul. That's the end of my haul. Well, hello. Hi, yo. That's the end of my haul, I think. I'm pretty sure that's what I ordered. Now, we can. Am I yelling? It feels like I'm yelling. Now. Now, this, I've been keeping this shut <laughs> because last week's page <laughs> went, <laughs> it has a mind of its own. And I have to tell you that I have not been back. <laughs> okay. So this, like I said, I forget if I showed this or not, but I don't remember it because I would have remembered talking about it. But this is what I've done so far. You know, we kind of had the colors in here. And then I had a bomber jacket because the way her, the way I had the initial um, shoulder, it was like a bomber jacket in my mind. Well, I didn't think I needed any anything to look at uh, the girls yeah <laughs> and then i messed up <laughs> so then i took my broken well this split off this busted and then i just cut it because um it was easier for me to handle so i just keep see and i just went in so it made it not so funny looking because, you know, yeah. <laughs> so I just, I just took the time and I did, I put gears on. So it's halfway decent. <laughs> now this one, I'm not sure if I showed these or not. But she reminds me of um, the Partridge Girl, Susan Day. She puts me in mind of Susan Day. Back in the day. <laughs> anyway, so yeah. I kind of, now that I'm talking, I don't know. See, I don't remember. But anyway, all right. So, okay, now this. <laughs> <laughs> I put some gel medium and this thing had come up. I figured it would. So it's gel medium down. So now there's gel medium all around, all along here. 
this is where we left off from last week. And I got no clue. And like I said, I mentioned it in a few chats. But after I got off here, I go, oh, I glued Xandra backwards. She's supposed to be facing the lake instead of, you know. <laughs> So, yeah, I don't know if we should try to, and then I was telling Judy Saturday that I may need to make some clusters and strategically put them, you know, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I just tra strategically placed clusters. <laughs> just, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know if we should try. And then I kept thinking, I'm like over here with the greenery. Yeah, here, I've got them. Where the greenery is. Get the okay. I can yeah. here. Well, there's some greenery. Then I realized that when we're looking at it from this perspective, I could go ahead and cover this if I needed to. So when that little bit of paint, I'm yeah. I used my. The glue brush and a paintbrush is kind of just, it has a little bit of paint on it. <laughs> yeah, anyway. Yeah, so, yeah, this is where we left it. The clone girls, Xandra and the clone girls. Uh oh, I wonder. Oh, here, a momentary scraping. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if we should just kind of Xandra and the Clone Girls. I don't know if we should just turn the page and start something else and and give my my brain a chance to further the story try to pick up the story Yeah, you can see I had some of the I had enough of the um white paint on that the the red fish got muted there and oddly enough here this has got a whole bunch so if I put hair on her she's already got I just have to color it now I have no clue I have not played with these should we play with them I don't know what they are like I said, water-based ink. Has anyone ever played with these? And I'm assuming this is the chalk. And it says to shake. And it's not doesn't say anything about gently shaking. It just says shake well before each use. So it doesn't say gently shake. And it does have balls in it. So I'm like, what? What should we do? Should we try to figure this? Or if we should just go to another page. 
what do you think we should do? And this, this makes Joan go cross-eyed. So she's no longer Sandra D. Yeah, because, okay. Well, let's see. Should we put some gesso down or gel medium? Oh, we can always do the gel medium. No, I don't, I'm assuming they're permanent. Permanent. Okay, well, here goes the sprays. I don't know if these are the same ones that um, Shauna got or not. There's no dot here. There's no indication. Okay, I'll just keep. Sometimes you have to make sure that this is lined up with this somewhere. But there's no obvious... Um, arrow or little dot there that says that this lines up with that none of that here i don't feel any of it so okay hmm well 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 oh how about some b paper yeah, I got it. I had to read it two times. Word of wanting. Let's glue. Let's glue. Let's glue. Be paper down. Be paper. Be paper. Be paper. Uh -huh. Be paper. Be paper. Be paper. Woohoo! 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 La 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 la. Oh, I'm starting to sing Christmas songs. Shh. I wonder if I'd wake Vaughn up if she's out there in the wallpaper land. You put me to sleep when you hum and sing. Okie dokie. Thanks for dropping by, Dot. Stay feisty. But be nice. We'll, we'll get the copper stick after you. Oh, okay. Just, yeah. Oh, and this... Yeah. And let's see. Hmm. <laughs> Short and sweet. Now I'm going chim chimney, chim chimney. Oh, but um, but um. Yeah, I tend to blend songs together. 
every once in a while, I'll have my husband laughing. Hey, stop rewriting the song because he's you know, his his background is music. Stop rewriting the song, but I wanna. Don't. No, that the you know it's very, very. And I'm like, I want to rewrite the song. Leave me alone. We're gluing, we're gluing, we're gluing it down. We're gluing, we're gluing, we're gluing it down. Yep. Oh, let's just make up a song. We're gluing, we're gluing. Oh. <laughs> I still have this thing, and it's in Shauna's box because eventually it will get to Shauna. I have to reconfigure. <laughs> okay, this is this was the day. It took three hours. <laughs> We watched wallpaper. We glued wallpaper. We watched it glue and dry. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Bits in it. Yeah. Because it will eventually, I will. Oh, man. Because after that, I mean, this wallpaper. <laughs> <laughs> but I will have to figure it out one day because it will go to her. Whatever I whatever I put on it will go to her. Yeah. But yeah, it's recorded three hours worth of woo. Watching this particular wallpaper be rather inconvenient okay what am I doing okay that should not be an issue oh <laughs> just get up and then move the chair and then sit back down oh wow that works who knew I suppose Ooh, yep. If our good spray, we need, maybe I'll get that gothic. We need some um, doohickeys, you know, stencils. We might as well, of course, let's see if I do that. Ooh, I wonder if that would be an interesting thing because these are plastic. I just had me an idea. Because these are plastic, you could put a paper towel inside and then put your um your stencil, your dirty stencil there and then do this okay okay i have to get me some paper towel let's see i'll go get my paper towel roll all right that will take care of the stencils because i don't didn't really plan for that last week i like i, I think i'm Boy, I tell you. Okay, Judy. I ended up not going to the Pettibon. I did a little bit here, but when I say Pettibon, it typically means 
I refer to going outside my home because I exercise. I do Pedibon all the time. But when I refer to it, you know, I mean, off site. And <laughs> my ear, I've, my skin, my, my ear, my left ear in particular, the skin around it has just been rather not, not fun. And when he has to adjust, so, so today I'm going to walk over like I normally do and, and ask him, say, hey, can you adjust me without touching my ear? And if, if he thinks he can, then I'll go ahead and I'll exercise. But if he says, oh, I don't know. Then I'll just come home and wait until it, yeah. Because it's, no, it's, yeah, I can't wear a mask. You know, the, I have to do a, sh yeah. I can't, I just, yeah, it irritates. And it's like my top of my ear is like really, and then, so I'm like shield. I have a shield, one that gets, that's um, to the forehead. And it's so snug that my glasses, it, <laughs> but it works. We went and got last Tuesday. Sometimes I wish they'd make up their mind. The, um, we walked into the blood draw place because, you know, we had to get, because it was part of our physical. And uh, we walked in and I thought, oh, yay, I get to wear my shield and, and yay, no hassle, no problem. Well, I couldn't wear it <laughs> because they said you can't. And I'm like, really? I wish you guys would make up your mind. And anyway, um, so I'm sitting there. Of course, when while she was drawing, I kind of my 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 head was like this while she was take she took the blood out of here. But normally what I would do and then it started bugging my eye. So then I was sitting here. You can just imagine you got the mask on, right? And I have my e and I have the 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 elastic on the left of my ear like this. And I have the mask itself holding it with my right hand, but my hand this hand is up here around my ear, so it's pressed up against my face. But the, but the um, the what you call it, the cord that goes around the ear isn't touching my ear. <laughs> and then, then, because it, you know, because we're having glasses, it's not always easy to have a mask on. So then, <laughs> and then, Someone must have been wearing something that I wasn't, my, my nose disagreed with. Because then my eyes, start, my right eye started twitching and I'm sitting here. These two fingers were pressing the mask down underneath my eye because the mask kept rubbing my eye. And then whatever was, whatever something, and I'm sitting there going, and I'm like, oh man. And I'm supposed to be pleasant. I'm supposed to be kind and I'm getting grumpier by the minute so i'm like going uh um you know i got through it and she she got the blood the first time which is you know pretty much they had to bring the vampire in <laughs> for my husband <laughs> but i tell you i was so happy to get home okay i'm over here looking Let's see if I got the right um, stencil book out. No, I don't think I do. Nope, that's the wrong one. Okay, so um, stick that there. It's differentiated because of here, this one. I moved some of my stencils around. Yep, this is the one. The red tab is the one has got the stuff I get from Xandra. So that's what I look for. So yeah. I'm sitting there going. And normally I don't have issues with that, but with this ear, I'm sitting here going, man, 
dang. But yeah, I wish they'd make up for mine because one different things and they just, they never just you know. <sighs> okay, here. This is the Gothic Finna Bear. Yeah, this is the right. This is the right way. Yeah, Finna Bear, and okay. And oh, I wonder. I haven't used this one yet. I light when Xandra she flashed it at us on one of her Sunday streams, and I go up oh, and I went right over to her shop and go, uh huh. Okay, we'll push this out. And I didn't real. I was so focused on this part here that I didn't really see this. Okay. And these are the little flourishes. Yeah, this is a newer one. Xandra Shop, 10, 2020. October. So this, these three should be an interesting combination. And I would get my paper towels. One moment, please. And paper towels. Paper towels. Paper towels. La 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 la. Paper towel. Okay. Okay. All right. I have three stencils. We'll do three paper towels. All right. Six because they're in the little ones. Okay, now we're going to get this. But yeah, when your ear... When the you know when the skin is irritated, it's just you know you just don't want to mess. You know, it's like uh, you know, like uh, uh. all right. So here we go. Ooh, we're going with the chalk celadon. Okay, here goes. Put a little bit of Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Just in case because there's no directions, I'll wipe them down. <laughs> oh, I don't think I want my cr cross getting. Okay, now here is the chalk burnt sienna. Ooh. It says it's the chalk celadon. 
Now, oh, of course, we have what people call Christmas colors. Okay, now here, let's get this. It has an interesting smell to it. Okay, now, oh, well, that was a swift moment. One moment. And there, we can rub it, rub it, rub it, rub it, rub it. Oh, yeah, just rub it on. <laughs> when you don't have room on your table. <laughs> there. Of course, I might have static electricity. Of course, these days, I live with static electricity. My hair is like um, Einstein. Yeah. Oh, I need this. Okay, now. Slightly awkward, but hey, it's okay. Now, do I want that third color? Let's on this one, I think I want the third color. The patina bronze. We're going to, like, right in here. Oh. This, oh. Oh. That, oh. I probably should have gotten me another. Oh, that is gorgeous. Oh, nope. Got to wipe it off. <gasps> oh. Wiki. Woo-wee. I like it. I like it. Uh huh. Uh huh. I like it. Uh huh. Well, all right. We'll just do it this way. It's okay. Wipe its nose. Yes. Wipe its nose. Ooh. Now with this. This goes more coral. Now. And that's what we have so far. Nothing real. But you know, actually, this is not a bad way of doing the stencils. I might just keep that. For that. Keep one of those for that. Okay. Now that's wet there. Wet here. Ooh, that's just, ooh, that is pretty. Okay. That's going to have to be like, maybe next time I'll get four bottles. <laughs> I'll get four bottles of patina bronze. Okay, now, well, I see now here it looks more coral. So, but I guess so. Because this here with the chalk, it does give you that coral. But over here, it just gives you that burnt sienna. Now, ooh, ooh, I'm sitting here. Ooh, I wonder. But then, I, okay, sprays. Do I have, let's see, what other sprays? Okay. Can I get them out of here without too much hassle? I know I have sprays. I have walnut spray. But sometimes, okay, what is this? Is that the vodka one? Oh, yeah. 
This is tea with alcohol in it. And the okay, this is the this is my one and only distress oxide spray. And of course, you figured it vintage photo. Okay, so Oh, I don't, I haven't used it yet. <laughs> I don't think I've used it. It's like, it's so precious, you know? You get that. Oh, I did get my, I did get a card from Teresa. I have, and I laid it down late last night and I, went to get it this morning to read it and <laughs> you're not there where I thought it was. So, all right. So here how do I want that? Oh, okay. Well, let's see. If I'm going to, how bad if I do this and cover my top, the front of me, because my the front of my body is right at the edge of the table. Okay, here goes. <gasps> oh. This has a wide spritz. This one has a wide spritz. Oh, it's pretty with that um, patina bronze. Okay, now this needs to be... Now that these are dry ish, we can put this. Oh, it did work. Put this in and rub it. Did I type something bad? I don't see anything. I don't see anything. Kimberly, if you're paying attention as a blue shirt, is there anything? Because I don't see anything. Who knows? Okay, now that's an interesting thing. Okay, so the Distress Oxide Spray has a wide... It puts me in mind of when my dad That's actually kind of cool. The the this the and the icy part the icy water cracks over top of this here, the gothic words. Let's see. Some of these don't always work. See, these are some of my really old ones. Let's see. This is, is this the one that has my vodka in it? Hmm. That doesn't smell vodka. All right, let's see. This, I believe, is coffee. It doesn't smell like it has. Okay, let's try this. Oh, 
Okay, this is actually one of the um, this is actually one of the um, um, I want to say Nina a long time ago sent Dee Dee some things. Oh, wow, this didn't get completely. And um, the pots of stuff. Oh, cool. Oh, look how that blended with the, um, with the oxide. Ooh, look at that, the oxide. Uh, I think this is like the silver. Um, oh, what are those? The ones that need binder. The dry powder that needs binder. Yeah, I don't see anything. Well, not magicals, no. Magicals have binder. Um... Oh, what is the little pots? Um, oh. These. These things. Hold on. I found them. And these things. Um, these are the ones that I got gifted from Dee Dee through Nina, I think was her name, Nina. She sent a whole bunch of art supplies that she hadn't been using. They're, um, Pearl X. They're Pearl X. And I think that's the silver one. And it must be with distilled water because there was no scent to it. And that's, it looks like it's coffee, but it's not. It's, see, it, it's like a silver. Or it could be this, let's see, it could be, it looks like I've got a gray here. But I like, look at that, I like that. This is, hmm, color, come on, color, where are you? Antique silver. I think that's antique silver with, um, Okay, but oh, I like that. And with the distress oxide, it, it it went with the distress oxide. It it played with the. All right, I have my walnut ink. And this is my flat Fabio. And it is the Sandra D. Sepia. So let's go with, let's see what about that through a stencil. Let's see here. Do we need more some over here? Let's put some lettering over here in green. Yay! A little curtain here. Oh, <laughs> okay, well, all right. Okay, fine. Go that way. Go that way.
Now, Sandra D. Sepia. Here we go. I get kind of scared to do it and then it does the blop like that because I get scared. I should just, you get scared. Okay, so that blended did that did something underneath. Okay, so this has got to go. Okay. Into the file folder and wipe it down. Wipe it down. Wipe it down. Okay, now let's get this. Actually, okay, that's still got some there. Let's turn that around. And do some oxide and see what that does. Do another curtain. Wipe its nose. And let's add some of this, what I'm assuming is antique silver, based on the way it came out here. And now it's coming out dark. Isn't that funny? Okay, so this right here must be the gray. Now this is coming out coffee. Interesting. So this must be the um, oxide. That gray must be the oxide part of it. Okay, now let's see. Okay, let's. All righty, let's um, okay. Now, interesting. I'll say, okay, I see, I see the gray happening here, but not as pronounced as over here. But the gray is happening right in here. You can see. You can see the the oxide spray um, turning that gray. I'm gonna do a. This one stencil didn't get as cleaned off as I thought it. Okay, so this must have coffee and distilled water in it, okay? Actually, I think I just want to leave that on there. Well, no. Well, I typically, 
Because see that to me, that'd be backwards. This is the front. Yeah, no, I'll, I will, I will wipe it off. Um, and yeah, my, uh, my Kleenex <laughs> definitely has. All right. I like my stencils to go one way when I'm using them on the jelly plate. They, um, you can tell where the, where I spray and where I don't spray. This one, I'm having an issue with it because I don't. Okay, so this one must be the top. Okay. And this is the bottom. Okay. Now, I wonder. Now I want to get my distress inks out. Maybe we can do a little bit of that. Okay, um, we've used those two. Let's see about, um, I'll go ahead and put these in here. And see if we can start smooth this out a little bit. Okay. I've used pistachio on this. I can tell by the So this is the this is the front side. Okay. Interesting. They have a this the inks have an interesting scent to them. It's not a bad scent, but if you got to get down, if you get, I wonder if they have a garnet. I didn't, I don't think I saw a garnet E1 in their sprays, 13 art sprays. Hmm. Now, ooh, Stabilos. I wonder. I got these, the woodies. Ooh. Ooh. Well, hey, you know, we're... Hey, welcome back, Judy. We're playing. Um, oh, yeah, I, I put the... I bought the... I bought the gold and silver separate. Because I wanted metallic. I figured... The tin pack plus silver and gold would be all I would need in terms of, you know, I figured this was all, this was all I would need. And then I have these. So let's, okay. Um, so with these, getting them through a stencil, um, I would have to mark on something um let me get these out of the way here and and that, yeah it's okay we're we're playing with new product and all that i even got my d paper out it's almost been an hour okay i need to set this down somewhere all right and let's see, I'm looking for white surface. Come on, um, something that I can, plastic. <laughs> really? You would think. Well, I'll just get a, I'll be right back. I'll just get a this. <laughs> 
cottage cheese container and these don't really have names to them but i mrs brown do it now let's go let's do with a pop of color um staying within Ooh, yellow i wonder that might be a little too much contrast Okay, what I'm trying to do, I need, what I'm going to do is I'm going to rub them here, and then I'm going to take my finger and rub it through the stencil. Because I don't want to, ooh, let's go with the, let's go with the, okay. So let's see here. So I'll put 25 minutes. And you know, hey, we don't, we got a little bit accomplished. Doesn't have to always be, but we're playing where this is pretty. But that, that just really, that was interesting how that coffee turned out so great to make me think it was the, the um, Pro X. All right, no. Okay, we're going to take the green. Okay, these are permanent after water. So let's see. If I recall correctly, they are permanent after water. So how am I going to do that? If I rub it through, ooh, this is my um, acorn colored sponge thing. Hmm. How are we going to do that? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. We, okay, I could. Well, let's see. I'm going to rub this. No, it won't rub. Well, yeah, it came off. Hold on. It Okay, it it's um very faint. Okay. It is coming off. It's just yeah. And I'm th trying to think. Ooh, let's blend some colors. This would be time consuming. But I'm thinking, you know, I'm trying something out. I'm thinking a stencil. Let me try a stencil on the finger. It would wear the finger out. So let's try a stencil. Where are my new stencil thingies? They're not there. Oh, there's one of them. Oh, yeah. There they are, right there. All right, we'll try a stencil brush. All right. And this is still a bit damp up here, so ooh. Let's do some more red and green. I'm assuming that will make some kind of a um, well, I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, some kind of an orange, like a peach, maybe. From the way it's showing up here, the lime green and red. 
Okay, so I'm going to bring it up in here to where it's still moist. And see what it's doing. Okay. Well, I'm assuming you guys are entertaining yourselves. Oh, no, be careful of the stencil. Delicate stencil. Get busy. Oh, that's delicate. Oof. Delicate. Oh, and it moved. <laughs> well, let's see. Hmm. A bit time consuming to do it that way. Through a stencil. I don't necessarily want to get these wet. Um, oh, let's see. I don't want to use my, cannot use my watercolor brushes. So I'm kind of stuck. Let's see. Water. Where's my water? Water. Come on. Oh. Seriously? My water. Oh, there it is. Thank you. My water. My water. All right. Let's get this moving and a shaking. Let's open up the gold and silver. And la 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 All right, let's see here. Oh, I don't think that's going to work. I'll just use the stencil brush. And I'll just use this. It's not really what I want to do, but... Okay, let's add some of this over here to the on this. Okay, now that's turning out a little weird. Oh, now that's weird. Okay, it's mixing with the other things. Oh, interesting. Okay, now get this. Okay, what am I doing? What am I doing? Um, paper towel. Okay, paper towel, paper towel, paper towel, paper towel. Okay. Well, hello, Tulip. Okay. Hello, thingy too. Yeah, okay, it blobbed. It blobbed, but that's okay. You know, hey. So it needs to be drier, not not as much water. Let's see here. We've been trying new product. Uh, 
Um, I'm assuming it's a um, American. If you don't have it, yeah. All right, so let's see. So it won't. All right, so let's see. This here, it needs to be spritzed or I'd almost leave it. But okay, I'll we'll spritz it because, right, they are permanent when dry, but you have to activate them, if I recall correctly. Let me read. Let me see if that's on here. Unbreakable, strong covering power. Um, I'm pretty sure they're, um, you have to activate them to be just like an ink tints, you have to activate them and they're permanent. Oh, heavens, that's about what? Three or four years old? <laughs> well, that's an interesting image, Safia. Um, some things you just can't undo. Oh, my giggles. All right, so let's see. If I wanted to, the, it went through the stencil here, okay. But not here. And when I rubbed it with my finger dry, let me, here. And it went up in here where there was still a little bit damp. Hmm. Hmm. Well, yeah, yeah. Um, well, what I do, like with this one here, Safia, I just did two. That way, if I need, to, yeah, and then if you only need a half of one, then you just do a half of one. Got a little art journal. Cool, Safia. And then just like, well, let's dissect what Safia said. And then I'm like, what was going through her head when she said that? Because I'm thinking, I'm so. You know, it's like, I'm like, well, hmm. interesting. Ooh, it zipped the first time. It unzipped the first time. Wow. Okay, let's see. Uh, here, here's the second one. <gasps> Look at that. It unzipped. Wow. Well, let's, what was going through her head? 
Because I'm sitting here going, hmm. All right, now let's see. Ooh, silver and gold. Yeah, they're the Stabilos, the Woodies. Um, back in 2015, when you guys were going gaga over them, I never got around to it. And then Marta was using them. And I thought, you know what? I'm just going to get me some. I listened to this one at, at nighttime between just instrumental music as I'm nodding off. And sometimes I will go, she's uh, Chinese. And I don't know how to pronounce her name. I don't even know how. But it's basically, because she's speaking Chinese, it's, it's a sound. It's not something I understand. So at nighttime, and my husband's like, like Turn it down a little bit, you know, okay, but you can, you can listen to it. She's one of those, the, um, interesting, maybe they have some kind of a, were you going to say something like a little iffy? Interesting. Hi, Laura. Yeah, you have to mix your caps and your and your lowercase. Okay. And yeah, because some. Well, what's funny is, yeah, nothing dodgy. Okay, yes, yeah, sometimes they. Um, I was bugging Judy. Judy never saw it because they kept erasing it. And I'm and I'm a mod and they kept blooming erasing me. And I'm like, seriously. Ooh, Laura. And Okay, Judy got her fix. And um uh and it was the emoji with the gracho marks. And then I put words to it. <laughs> I put words to it. Something and it kept so I took a screenshot and I sent it to Shauna because it was during Shauna's stream. And I says, I don't know what's happening, but they're deleting me. It stays in chat for about, and I timed it. And so she would be aware. So she'd be aware. I took a screenshot of it. So she'd be aware in case, you know. <laughs> okay. Uh oh. <laughs> the so anyway, you know, so yeah. But ever since the faux pas they did, um, Yeah. Oh, interesting. And I, no one's touched anything. That's interesting. Okay. So, yeah, see, Google. Yeah, Google. Now, that's a new one. I've never seen the Google moderator team. So, yeah. Hi, Beth. It's random and weird. Yeah, so 
yeah. So they must have felt that I was being really not polite to Judy when I was using the Groucho Marx <laughs> emoji. <laughs> I think I still have it. And it was nothing dodgy or anything. It was just bugging Judy, you know. <laughs> Judy <laughs> Yeah, so yeah. <sighs> Yeah. Oh, good pen. Good dot. Anyway. Yeah. So let's see here. Hmm. So if you smudge it in with your feet, if you smudge it in with your feet, right? This is my foot, right? <laughs> if you you get this, <laughs> and remember, activated once it's it's like ink tense, if I recall correctly. Once activated, it's permanent. Okay, so these are three of my new sprays and actually some of my newer stencils, some of them I've played with. Now, let's see. This is wet, so let me, like, uh, yeah, I know it's wet. Don't. Okay. <laughs> I have cute toes. I have cute toes. So there. Just saying. Okay, we're going in for some gold. Gold stabilo. All right, let's see. Let's see if I can get some of that shimmy in there. It's right here. I think, yeah, that's just way too delicate. I want to... This is not too delicate. It doesn't have any super delicate. <laughs> Maybe it's because. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. Well,
Now, I don't know. I, well, I don't, mine's not for kids either. I don't know. It's hard to know what, it's hard to know what they're doing. All right, let's put some cracks in here. Some ice cracks. Gold ice cracks. Now, so I don't see any of that on my. Well, I, yeah. It objects to the digits at the end of one's feet. <laughs> well, we're getting a little bit of... Maybe they're going through a... Maybe they're doing... They're doing a cycle thing today. You know, they're doing something in there. Hey, let's see what happens with me. I'm going to talk to Safia. And let's see if that... This is, um, I don't know, I'm not on my phone, so it could just be only an emoji on my phone. So I'm, for a minute there I saw it pickled. Yeah, so, because that's what I call Safia. That's her nickname. Safia's nickname is All right, so I don't know. <laughs> Hi, Janice. <laughs> Safia. <laughs> Special. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Janice, yeah, it's your turn to be special. Oh. 
toes <laughs> were towed away. <laughs> That's just too funny. <laughs> oh, my head. Oh, my head. Latin favoritism. <laughs> oh my. Oh. You typed the sac the sacred word and it stayed. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Savvy. <laughs> Don't antagonize it. <laughs> oh. A lolly and a cracker. <laughs> Okay, now, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Judy will show you how. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, my. <sighs> oh. At least your word wasn't misspelled, Tori. <laughs> Well, what's going on now? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Judy's trunk. <laughs> okay. <sighs> oh. <clears throat> Um, the she must be dreaming, Kimberly.
Philadelphia. <laughs> Are you bugging? Are you seriously out of here? <laughs> Oh, the Safi is traumatized. Oh, <laughs> well, hopefully it's just a glitch today. <laughs> oh, it could just be something they're doing in the background. <laughs> okay guys <laughs> oh my head <laughs> from laughing oh my head <laughs> I can't do this and hold my head at the same time <laughs> oh mama <laughs> Mia <sighs> Glare suspiciously, Judy. <laughs> Oh, do I even want to click on that? Does it go directly to it? Or... <laughs> if it... If it... If, um... Okay, let me see. Let me see if it deletes my my toes. Let me see if it deletes my toes. Yep, it deleted my toes. So apparently it's the body part thing. Uh. 
Oh. Do I even want to click on that thing? Nope. I have. I can't. I can't leave. I wonder. Okay, well, let's check that out and see what happens. <laughs> Wait for it, Lena. Wait for it. <laughs> Poof. <laughs> deleted it yet no not not so far oh my word <laughs> yeah it's still there lena's is still there but hers is with a question mark. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, wow. It's, oh, I don't know. Well. <laughs> well, from now on, we can put a toe on it. And we'll just erupt in laughter. Put a toe on it. No longer put a bird on it. It's put a toe on it. Put a toe on it. <laughs> yeah, now that's interesting, Kimberly. Yeah, the the nursery rhyme. The little piggy. This little piggy went to the market. This little piggy. Yeah, and you, and you wiggle the toes. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, now that we, I think we've had a solid laugh for about a half an hour. <sighs> and Safia left before. <laughs> I gotta write that one down. <laughs> My version of the wingnut book. <laughs> okay, let's see. Where's a pin? We'll put it on here. Okay, come on. Seriously, where's a pin? Okay, come on. Seriously. You would think I have my thing here. Oh, there it is up there. Okay. I got to have a pin. I got to write that one down because that's hilarious. And all right, let's see. Let's see. Can we? No, I guess not. If I can put it in here later on, like in a label or something, a fancy framed label. Instead of a snow day, we're having a toe day. All right, Lena. And T O E R I. T O E 
our eye in there. Okay, and I'll go, not that I'm likely to forget, toe day. Okay. It's interesting. Okay, guys. Oh. Well, let's just say it's been interesting today. <laughs> oh. Oh, no, there is an idea, Kimberly. That was funny about the, the Janice and the, the two toes got towed away. <laughs> oh, we just need to misspell it. I better not say it because then it's like stupid. But that's an it, it makes you think about why it's doing that. Yeah, I need to go back. I can't get to that link. Hmm. Oh man. Oh yeah, my oh. <clears throat> Is that the Pobble again? Well, it's almost at the bottom of the hour and I need to go. <laughs> yeah, I need to go. Oh. Okay, guys, I love you. <laughs> yeah. It's definitely been interesting. Okay. <laughs> oh my. That leads us clear down to like some, some Shakespeare poems, Joan. Oh my. 
Okay, guys. Oh, man. I, I think I had to take some aspirin. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> okay. I better finish. Yep. Oh, all right. I need to. Okay. We're out of here. <laughs> Tori. <laughs> oh. All right. I'm out of here. Bye, guys. <laughs>